Apparently, As It Was by Harry Styles is out. So we're gonna look. It's only two minutes and 46 seconds long. He looks old. Old. Damn. Harry is haggard. Okay, that shot was good. This very dynamic. Yeah, the way that, okay, we're using, oh my goodness, okay. So the way that they're using the space and they're using the rig that they have, this spinning thing to the maximum. They're not like, oh, it's just, it's one thing. They're like, we're getting the above. We're having the choreography correspond. Like it makes it so much more meaningful. Did he change his directors? Like, why is this? It's good so far. It's 44 seconds, but it's good. Okay, this is kind of hilarious. Kind of love this moment where she, just flings herself out of the frame. Was that a stunt double? It was It was a pretty extreme move. X Games in the Harry Styles music video. What? It's good. What? Here we have a mirror, a reflection, but then it changes. And then we also have a through line using this circular motif mirrored in the next shot. You're gonna see it, ready? So boom, we're mirrored and then we're back on circular and then it pans out and it's this really freaking cool setup. Like this next bit, unimpressive, it's giving Gautier, right? Um, or it's like, nah, no, just somebody that I used to know. You know that music video. Yeah. 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 Okay, and then the rest of the music video is just Harry jumping around dancing. It's cute enough. Where are the credits? Why were there no credits? No credits in the bio. How am I supposed to know who made the music video? <laughs> so thanks to a little thing called Google and putting in Harry Styles blank 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 music video director, I found the discrepancy between his um, previous few videos and this one and why this one's so much better. Um, it's because it's a woman director. That's right, you heard it here. So Watermelon Sugar appears to be directed by this old white man. And Golden, we all know how I felt about that one. Mm -hmm. Go check the other video. <laughs> it seems to be directed, not seems to be, it was directed by these two clowns. What, what, why would you ever, why would you ever trust these two people in a creative way? Sorry to be profiling, but like, what do they have to offer? What interesting thought is bouncing around in their heads? I don't know. However, this new music video, as it was, directed by Ukrainian Tanu Muino. Tanu Muino. I hope I'm saying that right. Tanu Muino. And she looks like this. Yeah. Yeah. And she also directed Montero by Lil Nas X. We all know how fun that music video was. So Harry finally hired someone who has a vision, which is great. Um, I think I've said what I need to say about it. Like there's actual like ties between the scenes. Um, I mean, the wardrobe's not amazing. I was not here for that like chevron sequin unitard. Like you could have done something better, but that has nothing to do with the director and the videography. Um, yeah, like there was, there was dynamic moving parts. Like even that Gautier scene, um, there's this part of it where, I'll pull it up, where the background starts moving, which although I didn't really love the setup, um, 
at least that ties into the other room with the circular moving platform. Here in this room, we have like another, like it turns into platforms that are being separated. So here we are running with the theme. Oh, here's, here's the clip, wait. Yeah. So we're staying with the theme and this that's what creates like a stronger message like okay like the point is we're in rooms we're in spaces that are supposed to be stagnant but things are moving so the song is called as it was he's like it's not the same as it was so he's kind of like feeling trapped but he still has to move along right it all ties in makes a lot of sense like he's trying to move on, but he's stuck in the same place or he keeps running around the same ideas and the same places and his memories and thoughts. The visuals here are complementing the song, complementing the lyrics, which just like makes for a stronger bundle, a stronger delivery, a stronger piece of art. And there's still some very like organic moments like there are in the other music videos, but there's also a lot of choreography here, which like makes it feel more purposeful and intentional and like there's more effort put into it. So I like that a lot too. Um, as far as the song goes, I'm not super impressed, but I think it's, I think it's better than like Watermelon Sugar, for example. Um, I think it's like, I think it's definitely on par with what he's been putting out of like pop songs that are very like retro amalgamations and um, decent, you know, music to listen to for fun. So can't complain. I'm pleasantly surprised. I, I had no expectations. Um, my expectations, if any, I guess I wouldn't say I, have n I had no expectations because I expected it to be bad. Um, but it wasn't. It was decent. So I hope that he continues on this upward trend. Hey, washing machine. And uh, we get to see better and better stuff from him because who doesn't want to see good stuff instead of bad stuff? It's easy mathematics, love. All right. Thank you. Bye.